today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary position as always by Lee Dixon. And all about action from League One coming right up. It's Bradford City and they face Milton Keynes Dons. Thanks Derek, yeah, really looking forward to both teams producing entertaining football. Let's see if we get that. O'Connor Wood and whipped into the box but he dealt with that ball played in rather well and teammates to play it to Sibley looking confident with the ball at his feet O'Connor Sibley Now the attack promising as it was scuppered there And he takes on the shot. Well, body in the way. Pool. And news of a goal in the Blackpool match. Let's hear about it from Allen. It's a goal for Blackpool. 30 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Allen. Well, possession seeded. This looks promising. Playing with purpose and control. What can he do from here? Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Sibley. Pure ball control. Fruitful looking attack. Opportunity to take the lead. And that's a fine stop. It hasn't come to very much. I believe there's been a goal on the Queen's Park Rangers game. Allen. It's a goal for Queen's Park Rangers. 19 minutes played, 1-0. Alan Mack. Will he find the net? And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Reeves. Now, let's see what they can do here. Boateng. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Getting forward. Crossing opportunity. Happy birthday to Sasha Walker celebrating today from Brendan And moving the ball nicely. Well, it was a very good looking move, but alas, no end product. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. to the advanced position they could nudge in front the opening goal due reward for their efforts well they've made the pressure count they really deserve this lead well just look at the replay the keeper's a little bit unfortunate he thinks he's coming back out but just clips the inside of the post and it sneaks in One nil then. 
I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Gillingham. 32 minutes played. 1-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. It's Ben Gladwin. O'Connor. Wood. Sibley. And he's taken it away. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. O'Connor. Wood. Just not looking confident in possession. It's opening up for them. It's a perfect challenge. Over the touchline for a throw in. And news of a goal going in in the Ipswich Town match. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Ipswich Town. 42 minutes played. 1 1. Many thanks, Alan. Sibley. Doughty defending to win the ball back. O'Connor. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. And O'Connor here. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Sibley. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Simple save for the keeper. Well, he had to pick the fly to the ball up. That was all. Got behind it. Good save. And news of a goal in the Blackpool match. Let's hear about it from Alan. It's a second goal for Blackpool. 48 minutes played. 2-0. Thanks, Alan. A meaty but fair challenge. And it will be a throw-in. Well, many have wondered if they would get it over the line in terms of the deal. They've succeeded late. Well, Derek, I've heard the fees around £55 million. That's the type of money you have to pay for a quality player these days, and he is... Qu well, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. Wood. Sibley. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Space on the flank. He has time to play it over. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. Boateng. It looks promising. Might really be able to trouble them here. O'Connor. Well, 
Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Sibley. Wood. A change to the scoreline, I believe, in the Blackpool game. Let's hear all about it from Alan McAdally. It's a third goal for Blackpool. 64 minutes played. 3-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. And a substitution in the offing. It's Ben Gladwin. Reeves. Pool. He has plenty of support. And he takes it on. Still alive. Well, there's been a goal elsewhere. Alan McAnally with the latest. It's the second goal for Gillingham. 71 minutes, please. 2 2. Thank you, Alan McAnally. It's opening up for them. Promising sequence. Crossing possibilities. Sibley. Moving the ball nicely. Looking for that final pass. Well, it was a very good-looking move, but alas, no end product. Throw-ins given. Substitution time it is. Wood. Reeves. Oh, just couldn't keep the ball. Williams. And news of a goal in the Queen's Park Rangers match, Alan McAdally. It's a second goal for Queen's Park Rangers. 77 minutes played, 2-0. Alan McAnally keeping us right up to date. Wood. Just listen to the fans here, Derek. They've just kept their noses in front and these fans are doing their best to push them to the final whistle. Others to play it to. Boateng. Excellent challenge. Well, visionary passing. Cutting infield here. Wide of the target, and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed. Wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. Williams he's given us away it might be oh a vital piece of last ditch defending not a good pass has a go whatever it takes to keep them out crossing possibilities Real danger. It has to be. What an important piece of defending. Poor pass under no real pressure. Going well. Pool. Reeves. And there it is, the final whistle.